So Bob, what have we got today? Pulling up saggy pants pranks. Beg your pardon? Um, pulling up saggy pants pranks. Uh... It's exactly how it sounds, Greek. Right, right, right. So, let me get this straight. Pranks where you run up and pull up saggy pants. Yep. Pulling up saggy pants in the hood? Yep. Right, but why, why would you think? Why, yeah, but why, why would this be a good idea? Well, either they're brave or stupid, or they're just really, really desperate to be famous. Oi, what are these guys thinking? Me, personally, I just think they're fucking stupid. I wonder if wearing your bottoms like that is actually comfortable. But why don't you give it a try? Yeah. What do you think? Will I blend in the hood? I feel a bit exposed. <laughs> nah, man. Doesn't suit ya. Yeah. I don't know how they walk around like this. How do they not fall all the way down? Where does that come from? Well, I'll tell ya. Hold on one sec. So I've whipped out the Urban Dictionary on the website, Urban Dictionary, where the origins of this saggy pants style thing came from. So I'm going to read you uh, uh, where this thing came from, okay? So wearing one's pants around the hips so that they sag down and bunch up around the ankles. Originally, this was a prison thing that signified that you were another prisoner's property. Bitch. Uh, punks were forced to wear their pants this way so it would be easier for their masters to pull their pants down and butt fuck them. Oh shit. Uh, somehow this became a, 90s, 90, a 1990s fashion trend. Who would have thought that something that signified butt fucking we are turning to a train that still lives on to this day. <laughs> wow! Well, like... Where... Where did some guy... Where did a bunch of guys get the idea that this would be a cool fashion trend? And it's still going today. It still goes on today. By some of the most dangerous people out there. Unbelievable. People just start, I guess, young guys just started doing it in the street. They just started wearing the saggy, the saggy pants in the street and then that's it. It started. So anyway, anyway, let's get on with what we're uh, here to do anyway. So we've got a video here, right? We've got two guys who are gonna prank a bunch of guys in the hood, right? By pulling up, by pulling up the pants, right? They're gonna put up the pants. What's going on, guys? This is ET. This is Mo. And this is Ak TV. Today we're in the hood. We're gonna go up to people who are sagging and pull their pants up. Come on, man. That's disrespect, Yo, man. Pull your pants doing, up. Bro. See what kind of reactions we get. And I'm Bob. And this is the Greek. And we are going to be watching. Pulling up saggy pants pranks in the hood. Like why are these guys standing so far away from the camera? Are they that camera shy or something? Are they afraid they're, they're gonna have a zit on their nose and people are gonna see it if, they're, if they get too close? Every time they say something, they're doing this. What's going on guys, this is ET. This is Mo. And this is Ak TV. Today we're in the hood, we're gonna go up to people who are sagging and pull their pants up. <laughs> He's like, hey, how's it going? I'm Greek. We're gonna be doing something today. Yeah. Yo, bro, pull up your pants. Yo, let's go with you, my nigga. Why the fuck are these guys doing this? You see what just fucking happened? You see happened right there, right there. Okay, the guy that he got, the guy got smashed in the face. He got bitch slapped in the face, but not by the guy that he's doing it to, by a random uh, fella just walking along. 
He fucking saw this guy and he's like, right, bitch, don't fucking disrespect. You know, don't be disrespecting our style, man. No, don't, don't be disrespecting. You almost got knocked the fuck out, son. Yeah, that's like, that's like another, that's like one local like defending another, you know, the style or something, you know. I mean, the other guy, he just wanted to beat the fuck out of him. And, he, and the, other, the guy pulling the prank, he is lucky he got away so fucking quick. <laughs> He's lucky he ain't some fat turd, because if he was some fat git, no chance. If, if that was me pulling these pranks, I would have no fucking chance of getting away. I'm a fat fucker. So, <laughs> I, I would have... Oh my god, this is such a shit idea. Why would you want to do this? What is that noise that he's making when he's running away? <laughs> it's like he's getting off on it. He's like, oh, oh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> he goes, you know, he's, he's, he goes, oh, oh, he's just, and then he tells the guy, and then he tells the guy to chill. Chill, chill, chill. Chill. What? No. <laughs> You're touching the guy around his crutch area, whatever. Doing something with his, you know, bloody seriously. Like these, these guys that go around fucking with these guys in the hood. It's, it's, it's ridiculous because these guys can have guns, they can have knives, they can have whatever, knuckle dusters, whatever. Yeah, you know, they're risking, they're risking. Oh my god. Right, so here goes the other guy. Bro, pick up your pants. That's just a Oh, no, 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 I'm sorry. Mate. Mate. Did you see what he dropped? The dude was carrying, man. I just, what did I fucking say? What did I say? One of these guys could be carrying a gun. One of these guys, one of these guys could be carrying a knife or anything. What happened? Take a look at that shit. The guy drops a gun. Where the guy got so jumped, like where he like jumped from being like surprised from behind, he fucking dropped the gun. As soon as the guy put in the prank saw the gun on the floor, he fucking ran. He ran all the way home. No, 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 I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. I bet as that guy was running away, I bet in his mind he's thinking this better be worth the views. Yeah, well, I hope it was worth the views because you almost got a fucking a few holes shot in your ass. So you got one guy who got absolutely bitch slapped in the face, not even by the guy he was pranking on, but by some uh, other guy just just walking around. Saw what was going on. He saw what happened. He's like, nah, bitch, you ain't fucking disrespecting uh, the style, mate. You ain't dis disrespecting our style. That says a lot, though. As soon as, as, soon as a punk shows massive disrespect. It doesn't matter, if you, to them, it doesn't matter if you're, not, if you're not the guy that he's disrespecting. He's disrespecting your lifestyle. And that is why probably that guy in the red went the slapped him one. Have some fucking, you know, have some bloody respect. And that's what he was doing probably. What a pair of dumb asses. So that is all there is guys. So uh, this is how I'm doing my reaction videos now. I believe this way is much more fair of uh, using other people's content. You know, so if you want to see the whole video, go to the link down below and uh, go to the original video where you can watch the whole thing. And uh, yeah, that's how I'm doing my videos from now on. Uh, with with uh, some exceptions of movie trailers or try not to laugh challenges or try not to cringe challenges or stuff you know videos like that that would require you to watch the whole thing those would be the exceptions but from now on i'm trying to do videos now where i can create more original content in my videos and do and you know you uh, use other people's content in a more, much more fair 
uh, use, you know? So, anyway guys, don't forget to like, share, subscribe and comment and I'll see you guys later on the next video. Good night, God bless. Ta-ta!